Hi guys, so in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you one of the easiest way you can earn passive income and that is investing in banks, okay? So not just any kind of banks, digital banks, all right? So if you're new to this channel, we release videos all about how you can create multiple sources of passive income through investments, business, or online opportunities. So if you think those topics interest you, make sure you hit that subscribe button, click mo yung bell notification. All right, so let's get started. Hi guys, Tio Pilo here of freedomlabph.com and ngayon, let's talk about digital banks, okay? So in one of my videos, right, uh, I've mentioned that there are three major sources of passive income, okay? So I'll put a link somewhere in this video if you haven't seen that one. So I mentioned that there are financial instruments, online opportunities, and passive income businesses. So those are the three major sources of passive income. And yun nga, what better way, the easiest way to earn passive income is by investing in financial instruments, specifically mga banks. Okay, mga banks. Kasi again, you put your money and then kikita yung pera mo through interest. Okay, through interest. So, uh, passive income yun, di ba? Passive income. However, yun yan, the problem with traditional banks, okay? So, lagay natin dito. The problem with traditional banks is that uh, they give you less than, like, very less interest. Okay? Very less, less interest. So, in fact, as of recording this video, they're giving like 0.125% interest per year, okay? So, let's just move this one so you can see. I hope you can see it interest per year yan, di ba? So, grabe. Ang liit. Okay? Then, however ngayon, because of uh, technology, okay, we're in the digital age, meron ng mga digital banks. Okay? Digital banks. And that is what we're gonna be talking right now. Tapos, uh, ano ba yung mga digital banks? Why, why can they give good interest? At the same time, are they safe? and secure okay so we will tackle this one and then i'm also going to be sharing to you how you can get started and your personal experience with digital banks okay so yung digital banks okay start tayo ha? so yung digital banks says they can give actually as of this video three percent to four percent or even five percent per year okay five percent per year. Ayon ba yun? Yeah. So, yan yung isa sa mga advantages of putting your money in digital banks compared with traditional banks. Aside from the interest, okay, aside from the interest of digital banks, another advantage that they give you is that yung, yung payout ng interest na is monthly. Okay? Monthly meaning, you will be receiving yung interest of your money monthly okay monthly compared mo yun with traditional banks i think they're giving out interest quarterly okay quarterly so meaning if meron kang monthly interest okay diba? so that's passive income per month okay that's passive income per month so now you might be questioning like you might be asking like why why can digital banks give this much interest compared with traditional banks okay so it's very obvious they are digital online most of the transactions, everything can be done online. So if you want to create an account, download mo lang yung app. Okay? Download mo lang yung app, tapos you can create an account. Tapos mag-selfie-selfie ka lang. Diba? Selfie ka lang, tapos yeah, meron ka account. So basically, they cut yung mga overhead expenses. Okay? Nakat nila yung mga overhead expenses compared with traditional banks. Like traditional banks, meron mga branches dito, they have to hire people. Okay? So that's why, uh, anong tawa nito? Like, they can give one of the ways, one of the reasons why they can give higher interest, okay? So, because of that advantage. And then, at the same time, um, yeah, the next question would be, okay, so they can give, they can give good interest, um, online, convenient, but question is, is it safe? Okay? Safe ba yan? Safe ba yung mga digital banks? Okay? So, as long as, as long as they are PDIC insured, then, yeah, they are, they are very safe. Meaning, yung pera mo, up to half million is insured. So in case yung bank na yun, they close down, okay, PDIC will insure your money up to half million pesos. Okay? So at the same time, uh, meron ding mga traditional banks that are converting into uh, into digital banks. Okay? So if you're familiar with Union Bank, they're actually rebranding into 
digital bank na din. Okay? So, in fact, nag-try din ako. Okay? I tried also Union Bank. I downloaded the app, created an account online. Okay? So, everything was done online. I submitted my photos, nag-selfie, okay, to verify that you're a real person. Okay? And then, yun, after a few minutes, meron na akong account. Okay? And then, another bank na traditional, like East West Bank, they also created a digital bank. Okay? If you're familiar with Como, okay? So, Como. So, money mo, control mo. Okay? So, I think yun yung uh, control mo, money mo. I think yun yung meaning ng Como. Okay? So, yun yung mga digital banks. Some of the digital banks and yeah, they are also safe. Okay? They are also safe. And then, yeah, yun yung traditional banks and digital banks. So, the next question would be, ano ba mga, an, uh, what are these different types of digital banks? Okay? And how do you also get started? So, let's tackle that in the next uh, in yeah, after I erase all these things here in the whiteboard. All right, so now we learn that uh, digital banks can give this much interest. Okay, and the reason why they can do such thing, and at the same time, na uh, yeah, digital banks are also safe. Okay, they are safe. So, ano ba, uh, what are ano ba yung mga digital banks as of this video? So as of this video, um, I have experienced ING. Okay, ING is a digital bank. Okay, meron ding CIMB, okay, CIMB, and I've heard about Como, alright, and Discartech, Discartech, okay, and then actually Union Bank is also rebranding as a digital bank, and fortunately, uh, yung interest nila is, isn't, isn't um, that competitive, so, so let's remove this one. So, as of this video, uh, I think ING yung base niya is around like 2.5%, but lagi lang nagpo-promo, 4% interest per year, okay? So, I opened my account in ING, ito yung nakuha ko, 4%, and then they regularly uh, in, uh, they regularly do promo, 4%. For CIMB naman, uh, yung starting nila is I think 3%, okay, 3%. Tapos, nag-promo din sa ng 4% interest per year, nakuha ko rin yun. And then just today, I no, not today, but just recently, okay, this is exclusive offer to the to their existing uh, accounts, okay, five percent interest per year, di ba? Lakay nyo niya, uh, talo pa yung mga ibang bank uh, bonds niyo, eh? ibang mga investment like bonds, di ba? Como is around I think three percent then, three percent per year, and this card tech, I'm not really sure, I think three point one percent. So what I experience is ING and CIMB, yun yung experience ko and this one, I haven't uh, experienced this one and then and I'm pretty sure that uh, most likely after the next few months or even years uh, baka there'll be more than uh, there'll be more digital banks na rin, okay? So, yeah, just imagine, di ba? Like, these interests, okay? Tapos, monthly mo uh, you receive the uh, the interest per month also na no, hindi per month but yung payout, okay? So let's say for example, uh, hundred thousand, uh, tapos five percent, okay, five percent. So five, that's five thousand a year. So divide mo lang yun by twelve months, okay. So yun yung, uh, yun yung payout na marili receive mo every single month directly de deposited to your account, okay. So these are the dig uh, digital banks that I've known as of this video and. Let's get inside the screen. Okay, I'll show you in, uh, on my screen. Uh, ano ba yung mga ano ba yung mga ang tawag nito? Yung mga details each bank and how you could also open your account with these kinds of banks. Okay? So, let's hop on the screen and let's get started. All right. So, ngayon, uh nandito na tayo. I'm going to show you the first bank, the first digital bank that I personally have experience okay is called ing ing so ing.com.ph okay so as you can see dito um yeah get four percent interest rate okay per annum per annum yan okay so go cashless okay tapos yun uh, high interest rates made for everyone so we charge no fees for any transaction and there's no minimum maintaining balance to bank with us so that's that's very good diba so, no maintaining balance. So, isa sa mga nagustuhan ko with ING is ito. Uh, you can deposit your check. Okay? You can deposit by just taking a picture. Okay? Take a picture. And, of course, I also personally experienced it. So, um, 
you know, uh, back and front. Okay, tapos you just input the details, and then after I think two days or two or three banking days, uh, it will already be credited to your account. Okay, tapos uh, for you to cash in, naman. So if you want to deposit, uh, deposit from a bank uh, to ING. So yung ginagawa ko is from my BDO or BPI bank. Tapos I just transfer it to ING. Tapos yung yung check. Okay. Okay, so anyway, uh, enjoy a higher interest rates and no fees. So you just check it out, ing.com.ph. So the next digital bank is CIMB. Okay, so just visit CIMBbank.com.ph, right? .com.ph. So uh, I've also personally experienced this one. Okay, tapos yung good thing with CIMB is mas marami silang uh, pay-in and pay-out options uh -huh, compared with ING. All right. Tapos and then sa ING kasi isa lang yung as of the recording this video, isa pa lang yung product nila which is yung ING Save. Pero si CIMB meron meron siyang multiple products, okay? Multiple products. So meron silang UpSave account, okay? Meron silang um saan ba yung mga products ito? Ito Fast Fast uh, Fast and Fast Plus account, UpSave account. Tapos I also forgot to mention na if meron kang GCash Okay, meron G, G save yon yung G cash and yung G save that is handled by CIMB and I think the G save is giving around as of this video is three point one percent interest per year so that is still pretty decent okay and then ito naman uh, as of now uh, meron lang promo which is four percent interest per year then okay so yun it's pretty decent then okay and then uh, tapos yung isa sa mga nagustuhan ko with CIMB is ito um, wait first, ah, parang nag-loading. Okay. Ito isa sa mga nagustuhan ko with CIMB kasi I, I received this as exclusive uh, promo for mga loyal. Okay, mga loyal na account holders nila. So, they, they actually gave me 5% interest per annum. Okay, so that's pretty decent. And then, compare mo kasi with traditional banks, like they're, like they're encouraging you to spend 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 okay so uh you can save by by buying this one okay meron ka mga discounts hindi yung savings diba but cimb is really letting your savings work for you okay so they're really encouraging people to save money okay so that is why i like uh, this bank digital bank also all right okay so the next bank is como okay como this is by east east west bank Okay, so yeah, this is also pretty safe, okay, kasi from traditional bank uh, turning into digital bank. And then yeah, yung CIMB then and ING, they are all PDIC insured, okay, PDIC insured, pretty safe then. Okay, so ito, high interest rate, so grow your money faster with 3% interest per year. So no minimum deposit, no maintaining balance, okay. So just check it out, uh, como.ph, or actually you can download this one. Uh, by the way, all these digital banks, you can download it to your mobile phone. So you just go to Play Store or uh, Apple Store or something. Um, download, uh, you can download these digital banks, okay? And then, yeah, I haven't, uh, itong Como, I haven't personally experienced this one. Okay, I haven't personally, but so far I, I heard very good reviews then. So probably I also open, I'm gonna also open an account in Como, okay? So that was the last one is... Um, search na natin, Discard Tech. Tech, this is from RCBC. Okay, so actually, I don't think they have a website. Okay, but they, uh, nasa Google Play sila. Let's check na natin. So, Discard Tech. So, this is from RCBC. RCBC. Yeah. Or... Let's search this tech page. Try not to search. Yeah, they really don't have a website. Anyway, this is from RCBC and yung yung style nala is para silang uh, Tagalog. <laughs> Tagalog yung 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 sa kanila. Okay. So to encourage more Filipinos to um to, to save money, okay? And tapos, they're giving away like 3.25% interest, okay? So just like Vcash and all the other uh, banks, you could also do bills payment, you can deposit, you can withdraw your 
money. And usually, kapag uh, cash out, uh, it's really deposited to a different bank. Or for CIMB naman, uh, I think you can also cash out through like 7-Eleven and the like. Okay? So, yeah. Okay, so, as of this video, as of recording this video, these are the four digital banks. Okay? And then, yung personal experience is CIMB and ING. And then, meron din Como and Discard. Right, so union, that's how you get started in these digital banks. However, baka right now you might be asking like, ah, Tio, like, hindi pa rin ako uh, comfortable eh. Hindi pa rin ako convinced. Takot pa rin ako mag-invest ng mga ganito. Baka umula yung pera ko. Okay. So, I mean, like, I've tried it out myself and there are other people also who have tried it and, uh, ano tawag nito? And then they're PDIC insured and then at the same time, why not try it out also? Like, again, uh, you just put money like uh, small money, like small amount, lang, like 100 peso or 500 peso, and test it out for yourself. Okay, test it out for yourself. Because uh, actually, that is one of the reasons why malaki yung interest na because they're also encouraging people to try it out. Okay, and then of course because of this di digital age, because of the pandemic. Okay, uh, nakita nila na very important talaga na most people should also transition into uh, this digital. So, so try it out, okay? Try it out for yourself. All right, so that is it. That is the basic and how you can grow your money, uh, earn passive income through putting your money in digital banks, okay? Digital banks. And uh, probably in the next videos, pwede natin isa-isahin yung mga digital banks. Uh, ano ba yung mga features nila? Um, ano ba yung mga advantages? Again, disadvantages. And then, uh, but... As of now, yung, yung suggestion ko is just ra ra really test it out, okay? Just test it out. Again, you can put a uh, little money as a start and experience it for yourself, okay? So, that is it. This is Tio Ulu. And if you find this video uh, helpful and valuable, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Saan ba yung subscribe button? <laughs> okay? So, hit that subscribe button. And if you want more exclusive content about um, business, inter... Uh, entrepreneurship or earning income online then i also have a, a platform called freedomlabph.com okay so pwede ka rin mag subscribe on freedomlabph.com all right so this is Steve below and create your desired lifestyle bye bye